Hey there, welcome to my YouTube channel. Well, today I'll be taking you on how to create a verified paper account for your business or personal use. Don't forget, stay tuned, subscribe to my YouTube channel if you haven't subscribed before. Thank you. Let's get started now. Well, as you can see, this is my own verified PayPal account. I use my own email, then I also use my Nigerian phone number for it. It doesn't matter if you're actually using um, another country's phone number, but you're actually going to get your account open for you. Then your password, then this is my account type. I'm using a business account. You can also create a personal account also, depending on you, you have to choose, but I'm going to show you how to do that. But let's also check personal, personal information. Okay, I can just, I think this is okay. This is personal information. Okay, I think there's nothing different. There's nothing different there. So I'll just go. I'll just go back to uh, let me say summary. Or well, let me just go back to paper home page. Well, as you can see, this is my own verified paper account. You can see it. As you can see, you can see the balance, the amount of money I have here. Then also, if you check, you want I can also send money from here. I can see. I can send money from this account. I can set up a business and uh, business account. So request for money from people, depending on what I want. As you can see, it's all showing here. Then let me also check if I can. Okay, I think, I think this is account settings. Let me see what's there. Okay. So let me check. Let me check this where I can show you this account is verified. Okay, as you can see, this is how you know where this account I created it in United Emirates. As you can see the address, Abu. You can see it. I just put the I just put the address, put everything here. This is just like um a business account that's so can everything is the same. So that's it. Okay, so now let me show you how to also open your own verified paper account. Well, first of all, I don't want to log out of my own paper account. So basically, oh okay, okay, let me just log out of my paper account then. Let me log out. So, I was actually thinking of not logging out of my account. Just going to make use of another um, browser or another. Why open an incognito browser? Well, basically, if you want to, if you want to um, create a paper account, it's very easy. You don't need um, a VPN or any VPN service to actually create your paper account. As you can see, I'm not using any of my VPN service right now. So it's easy. First, you just have to go to PayPal, PayPal.com slash AE. AE stands for United Arab Emirates. Basically, you are United Arab Emirates. Well, there are different there are different types also. You also have US, depending on the one you want. If you also want to open um, a US account, you have to make sure the thing, you have to make sure instead of that AE, instead you put US, then you enter. But I want us to make use of um, AE because most uh, mostly they're not actually banning most accounts using AE like that. But most of them using US and the rest, they are actually getting banned most of the time. So let's use this AE. So I'll just go to AE. Well, I think this AE already, but I want you to see it again. So after that, first thing you just have to do is you click on sign up. If you're on the mobile view, you might actually have to click the menu button, then scroll down to sign up also. So basically, I'll just go to sign up right now. I'll click on sign up. Well, I actually have two email here open already, so I'll just make use of any one I like. So, as you can see, sign up for your PayPal account is free. You don't need to pay money to, to, uh, to create an a PayPal account, but most people might actually charge you to create a PayPal account, something like this. It depend on you, and you can also start offering services like this, creating PayPal accounts for people in Nigeria, in different countries, then you verify it. So, as you can see, I'm using a business account. And using a personal account, shop in your country around you from your computer. This is this business account, accept payments. Well, the difference between personal accounts and business accounts is personal accounts you don't have you don't have um, things like business setup. And in business setup, let me say you're actually running a blog or you're running a shop online shopping store whereby you want to receive payments from people, you want to make use of PayPal. You can just add the PayPal, uh, you can add it, you can, you can make you can make use of PayPal online option. You get and that is when you're using your business account but when you're using a personal account you, you don't have access to any of that depending on what you want but i'll just create i'll just create a personal account and show you this same thing also goes to business accounts but business accounts they ask you for your home address and also ask your business address those as you show i those as you saw in in the first part of the video i showed you about my own account so i saw uh, my own address and also my business address so that between business account and um, personal account so i'll just go to personal account then I click continue. 
then yeah it's a it, you select your um uh, country automatically as you can see united arab emirates so from there you just put your name put your name so i'm not putting my own name oh uh, that's okay let me just say okay put my name or let me put okay let me put my let me put my blog name on it okay okay then i put the email Mm, okay, let me put the password. Okay, when you come into the password, they may tell you to make sure that the password is actually it does uh, it has a uh, a cap lock. Like let me say, make use of capital letter, small letter, then symbol. So I'm going to try and make use of all of them. So I'll use a cap. I'll use um a symbol first, then use um a capital letter, then use a number. Then I'll do the same thing again here. Capital, no, oh. okay. Let's make it. Let me just let me, let me type the password then. Okay, as you can see, it's correct. Then I click next. Okay, so yeah, you just input your date. I'll just put 07. I'm putting any date then 1990. I don't, I don't want it to be too far, so I'll just put six nationality, yeah, United Arab Emirates, then national ID card number you can just basically put any number you like on national id card so I'll just put okay one number one six one four that's you can put any number any six digit number and for here you can just put a peer box number then the city um okay abu hill depending on what you want to uh okay then phone number actually okay okay i'll just put any phone number two four two two five four zero one seven basically this number i'm just putting any um united arab number united arab name country code is plus nine seven one so after that stay logged for fast guys for fast guys okay I'm, I, okay, I, I think I'll check out this one. Okay, let me check in this one. Then agree. No, I think this number. Please check the number. It's telling me to check the number. Mm, I think the number is correct. Okay. Hmm. What is this right now? Four. Okay, I think the number is correct now. So I can see I'm just random. I'm just putting the random number there. So after that, agree. As you can see now, the account is ready for use. Depending on you. So not sure, not sure. Okay. Not sure. Add card later. As you can see, the account is ready. Then link, 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 link your card. I think you can link your card for shopping. I don't need this one. Oh, I don't need. I don't need this one right now. Oh, this one. They asked me. They asked me for credit card, but I don't want to put this one right now. It should be away. Okay. Okay. I can skip this one. Okay. So basically, I have skipped this one too. As you can see, my account is ready for use. Ready for use. As you can see, everything looking nice. Um, nice. So basically, I'll just check my email. As you can see, this is my email. So they're telling, they're telling me to confirm. For me, I'll just click confirm. Click confirm my address. Okay. So basically, I'll just input the password. Then, okay. Then confirm my confirm email address. Okay, as you can see, complete it's completed already. Okay, let me cancel this one and come back here. I don't need, I don't, I don't save that one. Let's cancel it. Okay, as you can see, my account is ready. I can send money and I can also receive money too, depending on me. 
and I can secret a short pen paper.me link as you can see everything is actually easy to use paypal is actually easy to use so if you want to verify your account don't forget to email me i'm going to drop my email on this video and also going to drop my email in the description below if you want to verify your account with a paypal card from this country or any country i can help you verify it but you're actually going to pay some amount of money for that don't forget to subscribe to my youtube channel thank you